Once we got out of that situation, what we have, what we are seeing, we are seeing not much activity in this former bin area, uh, and we don't see, uh, but we see a lot of activity in this central part of the house. Well, what we also had, we had here bins, and at the same time we had an oven right there where Jason is standing, which we have removed yesterday. Okay, so that was active, and this part was didn't show very much activity, the central part. Now what we are seeing, there isn't much activity in here. There is, and also not at that end, but there is quite a lot of activity in the center. And we have this big oven. This is the biggest oven so far that we've had. And the only one of this uh, proper... Uh, yeah, we don't know yes. if it was a uh, uh, dome down. Mm -hmm. I think it wasn't. I think it was more like the ones that we had in house one, which had like a side wall like that. It doesn't give us really evidence of having a full dome. And um, obviously the oven was had the opening the mouth on this end. So it was used from the center of the house. And um, what we had in the back of it was a storage bin. Uh, actually, this, this was the basket, the storage basket that was set in the floor that went with the upper phase of the house. So we had here bins, we had storage here, 
and we had the noun over there. Now we have uh, deeper down, we had the oven, and then we don't have any other evidence of the activities that are contemporary with this oven yet, but we might when we go that deeper here in this area where the white floor is. So the white floor was from the, the phase when there, was, there were bins here, bin here, oven there. So now we're taking this down and we should be able to see what was going on next to the oven in that air, coal area. Um, so we have, re we have been removing uh, these series of white floors and packings and, and lenses of gray, uh, you know, the, the occupation debris. And we couldn't very well uh, separate all of them, as you know, that's almost impossible, has been so far. And, um, but in that sample, we do expect to have interesting stuff because we had uh, several layers of fairly nice gray occupation layer. So you, I suspect you'd be interested in that to see whether there is anything of a special interest. Now, now we are going, as I said, deeper onto the black, very, uh, very quite thick black and gray layer at which we will stop and then we'll take that as, if we can, as one unit. And that should be probably the most interesting for the plant people. Um, we are also, that's about it. We are not going to touch that oven yet for a while until we, uh, we are sure what's going on in here. And another thing that we have been doing is the re we continued removal of the pillar this feature up here. Remember we had two pillars, we had one here and one there that were holding the screen wall which was in the middle. So we have, we have removed the, uh, the southern one last year but the northern one we didn't have time to remove so we are doing that. That's also from the upper horizons of the house. And uh, that uh, doesn't seem to have much uh, of uh, you know, inclusions except for it has bricks and mortar and that's about it. But deeper down, as this, this, there was a round feature here, which was prepared um, for the pillar, and the pillar was stuck onto it from this side, the bricks of the pillar and the mortar. So when this was prepared, we, we can see that it was filled in and packed with the, not just bricks that were put in sideways, but also a lot of black, uh, gray deposits full of ash and charcoal and stuff. Since we had a lot of that sort of material around here, remember we had very rich deposits of, with a lot of uh, tubers, right? That was, that was right in this area. And I suspect that this, uh, this stuff inside is probably the same as that. So what we will try, we'll try to separate that and have it as a separate sample for you so you can see if it is uh, the same kind of thing. And, um, and for Heidi, we have, uh, oh, Slobodan has a very nice, where is Heidi? Oh, you're there, okay. <laughs> very nice obsidian. <coughs> Slobo, where is the obsidian? Uh, you have to show her, I can't box. see that. It's in the bucket. In the water bucket. It's in the bucket now. <laughs> it was on the floor. It's on the floor. Of yeah, but is it a tool or is it just a flake or what? I think it's a tool, but probably not. Right. <laughs> okay. So, anybody else of you people who have been digging here, do you have anything else to add? Uh, I have one more thing to say <laughs> before you add. This oven that we have here, we have been. Uh, we uh, were trying to find a rakeout uh, area around the oven, but it seems that the op because the oven floor was there, it seems the opening was towards the north, and right there next to the oven, in towards the north, we have a big cut, prehistoric cut that was made in the floor. So we suspect that the cut there was because of the floors which were terribly damaged by the rakeout. And that, that way we actually have lost the rake out 
We can't count on it, but we can probably get some of it here on the side. So we'll take that as a sample for you here from the eastern side of the oven because you know how they did it. They didn't really take out everything out, straight out of the mouth. Some of the stuff went on towards the sides and behind and so forth. So that's that. And then the last thing is that the, uh, conti we continued uh, digging the, the group burial over there in the, in the platform 162. And that burial is the features. Now, let, let me give you some numbers. The burial is the features 634, 644, 617. Right, Laurie? Oh, yeah, 617 is the old one, right, the first one. Is the yeah, and 647 is the current one. So cross out 617, put 647. Now, the units that we had here, David, what, what was your unit here, the one? Uh, 642. Unit, not, not no, feature unit, number. Uh, it's 6694. Okay, 6694 was this oven floor and stuff immediately under it. And that oven has a feature number from the last year, if you want that. It's 642 feature. And now the floors that have been removed here in the, in the central part of Space 158 are units. Uh, mm -hmm. Six six nine five eight one zero oh, four, and then Carrie. This. Which ones do you want? All the ones I've done. Yeah, we want all the units that you have done. Okay, so this was six six nine six. The packing above this. This floor or this feature. Feature. We are still talking about the series of the floors and packings in the central part mm -hmm. that have been removed. And so those units, uh, what, what was it? Um, 6696 and 6699. 6696 is here and 6699 is here. Right. And uh, what else did we do? That's about it. That's, mm -hmm. that's all the units that we have opened here so far. Yeah. There's a little bag from 6698. Right. You, you will also get a unit, 6698, six, okay, and that is the cleaning of the west face of the west wall. So you remember last year we started digging the middle here so that we can um, free the, this uh, west face of the west wall and look at it. And we did most of, the, of it last year, but Still, some bits and pieces of the min got stuck to the bricks and mortar, so we removed it all on the whole, this whole surface on the wall, of the wall this year, and that's that year. It's pretty, pretty small. So it will be all your midden material. Yeah. That you What we did, we had another unit in this north space of the feature of the uh, 158, which is, uh, what was that unit? Where's John? 6697. Okay. Six, six, what that will be, uh, that unit is just the remains of the floor that we have removed last year. And we had a, a bit of it still left in the corner and we removed that. So that is same as whatever we did last year. If it turns out to be interesting, then we'll give you more information on it. But I think most likely not. It was just a white floor with the king underneath. Didn't seem to be very rich uh, in any plant material or stone, lithics or anything like that. Okay, so that's that. Anybody else has any anything else to add about what you have been working on? <laughs> well, those two, well, just two units, so I don't know what, when we separate properly the occupation of what it is. Nothing. 
No, no, nothing. Okay. Well, the, the, the eastern section is a different unit of that of that oven, where the possible there's a lot of charcoal on this eastern side right here, right outside the oven on one section, and that's a different unit number. That's eighty one oh five. I don't know if that'll if, if they want to sample those or not. Yeah, it's all going to get, go through their hands. Now, <laughs> now, of all these units that we've mentioned, uh, it seems to me that for you, probably the most interesting one, the one that, you should, that we should make priority at this point, should be the one that you were doing right there where, where you had the, the black floor and stuff. What, what's that unit? 6695. Okay. So I suggest that we make priority 6695. Um, and, um, and if you want more priorities, if you, that is, if you don't have enough to do, <laughs> we can give you another one. And that should be David's, because that's to do with the oven. David, what was that one? The, the oven units, both of the... 6694. Oh. 6694, and and what was the second one? I think it's 8105. Okay. We can make those priorities if you... Unless you have some questions and suggestions on that. But you'll get much more nice stuff <coughs> soon from here. Yeah, I expect a lot of interesting, you know, cooking, cleaning type of uh, storing things because it's possible that we have another oven right underneath this. Not right under, but in the same area. I can see in the in in the section of that pit. But most likely there was another down here. So that's going to be good for you. Any questions? Uh, in terms of, oh, sorry, Lisa, I forgot. We, I haven't. <coughs> have anyone seen any bones here from this area? Any animal bones that we have we come upon? There any were some tiny bones over there, towards the wall. So that's the, that same unit that we made the priority. So you should look at that also um, as a priority and see whether you can but find anything. Nothing it, big, it's really, yeah, it's mostly. Uh, you know, floor stuff and, and packing and, and plasters. So um, your samples are probably going to be not terribly rich and interesting at the moment, but God knows. <laughs> and very purely thick, just that piece. <laughs> Should be able to process that <laughs> yeah, <I think> so. <laughs> quickly. <laughs> Um, I don't know, Laura, Laurie, have we made the, the burial, uh, Laurie and Bashak, have we made that ever a priority or mm. would we want to for any reason? Mm. I mean, now is the time because yeah. they don't have very much to do, mm. so if we want yeah. to prioritize yes. that. It's we actually, we, <laughs> Mira, 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 the unit is 669. Mira, Mira. no, he no. always prioritizes. Right. What's the word for it? Priority. The burial soils. Okay. So and so, I compare it later. Okay. So we should do it. And okay. what's the unit number? Six six oh, okay. Six okay. <coughs> and we are finding little bits of things for you, Lisa. Not a lot, but a little bit. <laughs> yeah. So. Cup of tea. Good. Yeah, because they're they're really in the middle of cleaning of the skeletons. And, and you should probably come and see what it looks like, and they should tell you. We, it's a totally different pre picture from what we had last year. We had an impression that it was a, a, a jumble of bones, human bones, but now it's different. Now it's a different jumble of bones. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so what we have here is we have the, the head here, we found out, is actually connected to the rest of the body. And if you ignore all of that, you can see it. There's the head, the arm, the... Um, the ribs, the pelvis, the vertebrae down here, the leg here, the knee, and then the foot over here. So that's one individual that we actually hadn't um, 
figured out with one individual last time. So we know that we have that one individual that is articulated here. And then this basin right here, I know it looks weird, but what it is is, is where the cranium was. Uh, one of the crania was that uh, we found last time and we took it away. But um, we found that actually it goes to this individual here who is also articulated. So we have two articulated individuals that we know of, and then this other jumble of bones and the other crania may be the one that was actually disturbed when they were burying these two and they threw them back in. We don't know if that other, uh, the non-articulated one is a single individual or not, but it might be. Two of them are juveniles and one of them is an adult. This one's a, well, juvenile 1920, something like that here. This one's an adult. And then this one that's scattered is um, a young one also, or younger, a teenager sort of thing. Anything else? Yeah. Yeah. Question? Yeah. Uh, let me just add something. You see the, the black deposits around, the, the soil that they are buried in. Uh, that, that's going to be probably terribly rich. See, look at that. Um, <laughs> it will come to you. That's my Yeah. Yeah, yeah. One, uh, uh, one clue is that we know that now under, under this house, in the deeper horizons, we have midden. So this house, this, at least this part of the house, Space 86, was sitting on an earlier midden. So this is uh, remains of the midden as they were, you know, digging out the pit for the burial pit. They were disturbing the midden and turning it around and stuff. So uh, it's going to be very difficult to say whether any of those remains that you will be finding will be part of the actual deliberate burial of these mm -hmm. remains with the individuals or, or just the remains from the midden that they were that, up. Yeah, that's why it's important to look at this mm -hmm. and compare the burial mm -hmm. so we can tell if it's the midden or it's specifically it's brought somewhere. Yeah. It's different. Mm -hmm. right. so. mm -hmm. Okay, so pay attention and also look at the other burial, um, you know, priorities if the, and in our house, that is. You should, you should look at, especially at the burial next door because that is at the, roughly the same level even though, you know, it, it, it wasn't so midden rich mm -hmm. soil, was it? No, until the very end. Yeah. The very end. Yeah. Yeah. I remember the, 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 the burial 631, but I don't remember the unit. Uh, I can't look it up. 6303. 6303 sounds right. Yeah, yeah. But that's the scarce number, actually. So I can't look it up for you. Oh, the feature number is 631. Feature number is 631. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. That's the two unit number. Should be a two unit number. I think I should have it here in my house. Yeah. It's 6303 is one of them. 6303 and 6283. Yeah. Yeah. And maybe there is a little bit of... Yeah, I think that one isn't as clear as this one, is it? Right, it's all, was all done in two I see it, but you know, we've been working on it, and so I can see it clear. And then you should compare it to yeah, another yeah. burial. It's not clear, right? Have, you remember the double We're going to make it really pretty. <laughs> <laughs> we have two children buried in this pit. <laughs> 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 and that you should compare to that too. And those unit numbers are? 6681, 6682. Okay, here I come. 6352. There is more than that, though. Wait, yeah. how to wait? Okay, it's 6689. Okay. How about 6625? Was that part of it? Yeah. I'm not sure. Mm. That's like what I have. 6680. No, 6680. We'll have to look at it down right? in the. Which for which one? Oh, yes, sorry. I didn't even know. Yeah, yeah. you should ask. <laughs> yeah, we were just working on it, so. Yeah. Six, 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 eight, one, eight, six, eight, one, and eight, two. Sorry, I didn't. Six, eight, yeah. one, six, six, eight, one, and eight, two. For these two. Yeah. For these two. Right. Yeah. Six, six, eight. And six, three, five, two. Also.
Yeah, I have also that unit. I'll check what it, what this is. For this unit, I don't remember. So I don't remember. I remember some of them. Yeah, I didn't hear you also. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Also yeah. I think they are. Uh, no, I cannot tell you that. Let's check on that in the lab tonight. I'm not sure. I have to look on, on the unit sheets in the, which are in the computer. Um. Okay, so that's that. That is in terms of the burials here. Do you guys have any yeah. questions for us? Also, it could be important to compare these yeah. two. They have different units. So we can see actually if they have consistency. Sure. But can we make the priority now because these are last year's units? It might have been prioritized last year. If they weren't sorted yet, then we have Okay. But if we were to look at last summer, then we, could, we should have photocopies of the unit sheets because we bought them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. we all, okay. So why don't you check on that whether they were prioritized? Yeah. Because yeah. they were right at the very end. Right. Yeah. yeah. It's possible that they didn't get sorted out because they were at the end of our expedition. It would be good to do that now. Okay. Well, that's it. From our side. <laughs> so if you want to hang around and look at, at us for a little while, you know. <laughs> And hey, I found a little bit of a tip for you. But a little bit. <laughs> I'm, I'm not sure, but I think that I do have a fair amount of small pieces mm -hmm. from one of the bears. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'll check on that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do remember finding, a, yeah. I don't remember if it was this one or this one, but I was actually finding it. It seemed to me it was when we were going down to the upper levels of this, we were finding lots of little mm -hmm. bits. So are you are you at all going to go to the Polish area, or is it too early for you to? They're not um, sampling at all until we get to you with it. Oh, okay, right, because they are they're still in. They've got like ten barriers. Okay. You're at point four seven, and we have cool. Let's go. Do you want to go down for a little while? Okay. Hey, Laurie. Yes. And Okay, now. Okay. Okay. And we're going to keep working. <laughs> of course. I hope. Well, Carrie is. She's under deadline. The, those two are under deadline. You can tell. Uh, listen, guys, you have to keep your area clean, otherwise, you won't know what you're doing. Yeah, Rush that top. We're on something right here. Right oh. <laughs> Now, one thing I forgot to tell you, remember we had a little bit of paint in there? Okay, yes, so that's probably gone away. No, no, it's, I think it's... And what about the, um... Well... Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Maybe you should brush off now and see whether it still exists. If it does, you should just cover it with, with something. No, it does. And, uh, let's see if... I think it's accidentally there, but, but not. Okay. Yeah. You should never carry, you should never have that much soil right next to you. It has to go in the bucket. This one is point one. Because you're going to stick on it. Point one. Point one. Oh, just a second. Yeah, we're going to make it zero. Do you see that? Yeah. And I'm still here to say what. Right there. And the upper one is 0.075. So. And then, yeah. 
all the way from, from where it's excavated. Six, what did you say? 0.63? Right? Um, is that it? Okay, okay, that's okay. Yeah. It's ideally it should. Yeah. It should ideally. But, you know, don't worry about that. That's, that's, uh, six, six, yeah, what's that? Where is that? Yeah. yeah. In the floor. Either on the floor or just this side. Okay. Laura? Mm -hmm. Laura? Mm -hmm. Instead of nails. Sure. Okay, uh, okay, it's Kozlov. 